There's a lot. Um, obviously, uh, it's an honor to get the opportunity to play here at UMD in front of you know my family and friends in my hometown. And um, you know, I just came in to try to help the program win as much as possible, and to have the success I have that I've had has it, been pretty special. So um, it's, it's definitely been a lot of fun for you know, my three and a half years that I've been here. It's, it's kind of crazy. Um, you know, I never thought I'd kind of get to that level as far as you know, my success. Um, you know, I just like to go out there and play hockey just like anybody else and go out and have fun and, and play the game that I love with my teammates. And um, you know, my coaches have given me opportunities to be successful. And um, you know, I, I guess I've had a little bit of luck as well. So, to be mentioned, that kind of group of people is, is pretty special and it's, it's definitely something that I'll, I'll take with me for a long time. It'd mean a lot. Um, obviously, you know, it's the top award in college hockey, you know. Um, we've had four past winners, uh, great hockey players, and then to try to be the fifth would be great. Um, you know, obviously there's a lot of competition out there, a lot of great hockey players, and it's a tough thing to achieve, but um, you know, I'm just going to try to keep playing hard and, and hopefully uh, things will work out in the end, uh, at the end of the season. You know, it's been different. Um, obviously, I was, you know, blessed with those two players on my line. I mean, you're not going to find two other hockey players that are that similar to a player as me. Um, I mean, it's, we had so much chemistry, it was, it was pretty much, it was uncanny. Um, we knew where everybody, each other was on the ice at all times. and. We played the game similar and always made plays and found the back of the net. And um, you know, it's sad to see him leave. But this year, uh, you know, I've been put with a couple different guys. Uh, most of the year was Seidel and Basaraba, and two great hockey players that I think I've gelled with well this year. And um, you know, we're just going out there and then making things happen and then finding the net as well. So I, I think it's been a great season so far. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, hands down, it'd be another national championship. I mean. You know, Hobie Baker would be cool, but I mean, for our, for the team to win a, nat a national championship, try to repeat, um, would definitely be one of the most special things that uh, ever could happen to, to a guy in college hockey. So, um, you know, that would definitely be right at the top of my list, uh, just to try to go and repeat and get a second national championship. You know, last year was, it was definitely difficult. Obviously, we knew we had the team to do it. Um, you know, we obviously started playing our best hockey at, at around playoff time, and um, you know, we just kind of got on a run there after the final five. Uh, you know, things just kind of fell in our in our favor, and uh, we just kind of ran with it and played some great hockey. Um, this year, it's it's definitely been tough because after you win something like that, you got a target on your back. You know, you're getting teams best every night, and um, I thought I feel like we've dealt with it well this year. I feel I feel like we got a great team. And um, you know it's just it's just tough to to bring that intensity day in and day out and try to stay on top. And I think um, you know we got a team that's capable of doing that this year as well.